Hey ghouls, it's Plays, and today, as you can tell by the title, which is down there, I always point up, but it's down, I have another Spooky Box Club unboxing. I'm so freaking excited every time this comes around, I'm like, <laughs> spooky treats. <laughs> um, so a couple of little things before we start. First of all, the background is different, and the lighting is a lot better <laughs> than normal. Um, well, right now it is, I don't know what it's going to be like when I get it on my computer, but for now, the lighting's relatively good. I'm at my mum's house because my parcels get delivered to my mum's because I live in a student house, and I do not trust my parcels in that area, so they get sent here instead. So I've taken the bus, I'm home to film, <coughs> losing my voice. Um, yeah, that's the first thing. Second thing is two boxes were received in this this time. We have Spirits and Spells, which was the December box, and we have Dead Cute, which was the January box. But I'm only going to be opening the Spirits and Spells box because I've done corresponding makeup with the Spirits and Spells. Do you see this? The gold, the gold. Got my little witchy ring on. I was feeling. I've got my earrings. Which please, how cool are these? You can't really see them, but I'll post them to Instagram in case you guys are interested because they're really cool. Um, I was feeling the spirits and spells. I based it all off of this little sticker on the box that you can see there, which they post on their Instagram, which will be linked below. Um, yeah, so I'm only going to be opening spirits and spells today because I want to do corresponding makeup for the dead cute because I think that'd be really fun. I could probably link in a kind of pastel goth transformation also with that dead cute thing, creepy cute situation. I'm just rambling now. Um, before we get started, the sunglasses are from the Vintage Fair. Um, eyes are a mixture of Urban Decay and Kat Von D. Lips are NYX, my choker's from Camden, my necklace is from Primark, my top is Killstar, the earrings are H&M and the ring is from Christmas Market. I think that's everything, any questions pop them below and let's jump to it. So here we go, do I need scissors? No? Yes? No? So. What was the thing? Something fell out. Was it confetti? Woo! Oh my god! Oh, I don't know if I'm going to be able to show you, but it's like a little holographic ghosty confetti dude. Oh my god, that's so cute. Okay, so Spirits and Spells doesn't have a little intro thingy. Um, it just says everything that's in there, so I don't want to open it. Open it? I don't want to read it yet. So let's take out our doodads. Ooh, there's some exciting stuff in here. So the first one. Oh my god, that smells amazing. Something in this box smells so freaking good. Oh, it just smells all witchy and cute and fun. Um, okay. So the first thing we have in this little bag is that looks like a necklace. So dainty and nice. So it's a silver chain necklace, and on the silver chain is a little crescent moon. But it's quite a, a thick crescent moon. Thick. That's like a, you know the memes. <laughs> um, yeah. So it's not just like a little printed. What am I trying to say? It's like a good sturdy moon. <laughs> but that's really really sweet. That's a, a staple for any witch's wardrobe. A moon necklace. The next thing we have in here is, oh my gosh, this is so cute. <sighs> ah! Okay, it's a little pin that comes in a little pouch. It's got two bits so you can position it how you want and it is a teeny tiny broomstick. Can you see this? That is the cutest thing I have seen in my life. Oh my god, I want to wear it on everything, all the time, never want to take it off. Oh, that's so cute, that is adorable. So, I'm very happy with that. The next thing is 
Oh, it's a little charm. In one of the boxes previously, it was the box just before I started, they have charm bracelets. And so with other boxes, they get little charms for the bracelet. And I don't have the bracelet and I don't have any of the charms. So this is my first charm. And it's a little witch's hat. Oh, we can stop dangling. There we go. It's so cute. And like, this is so cute because if you're a witch, obviously a witch's hat's cute. But even if you're not a witch, if you're into like Harry Potter, that's like relevant, that's cute, that's something you'd enjoy. If you just like spooky things in general, a witch's hat's pretty cute. Oh, I'm gonna buy a little charm bracelet and that's gonna be so cute. Next thing we have is a lollipop and it's green and yellow. Um, I don't know what flavour it is. I don't know, but hopefully it's nice. Some cute little colours there. What's this? <laughs> Next thing, this must be what smells so good, is 20 incense sticks, which are for prosperity. Light the incense and affirm, blessings flow to me this day, my riches grow in every way. That is very freaking cute. So I'm about to be prosperous as hell up in here. Pretty nice. They smell so good. They smell like a perfume I bought from the witchy shop near me, which was, I think it was Night Queen. Oh, that's so good. Cute, 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 cute. Okay, this is a little red book of spells. <gasps> oh my god, is that a pen? Oh, it even comes with a little pencil that goes in the end. So I assume this is for when you're out and about in your travels and you find little ingredients or something that you want to jot down where you found it or you have any incantations you want to write down or I don't know, make some little sigils in there. So cute, look at the font, how cute is that? Oh, this is so cute. I I came at the right time for Spooky Box of Birds. I want to open that last because that's really exciting. So this looks like a print that says Believe in Magic and it has two broomsticks and a witch's hat and that's really cute. And this is so good because when I move out, we're getting a flat, my boyfriend and I, and we're gonna have just a wall dedicated to all kinds of creepy pictures and drawings and skulls and bones and cool shit like that and you best believe this is going right on up there with all the other spooky shit so i'm pretty excited the last thing is really really exciting and on the top it says new bone china mug made with love a lovely mug for you and it says authentic which is brewed brewed in hell it is a mug i'm gonna open it up for you guys I don't actually, oh my god, one of the ghost confettis made it into the mug. Oh, he's trying to escape. No, cute. Um, I don't actually have a spooky mug, so this is perfect. It has it on both sides, and then in the top, there's two little crossed over broomsticks, which is so cute. And every morning, I'll just be sipping my coffee, like, which for life. How freaking cute! Oh, this is just the best thing. Spooky box club is my life. I love it. I'm gonna open the other box now. <laughs> okay, right, let's check we got everything. Custom made mini book of spells and pencil. Yep, witch's brew mug. Yep, custom made witch's brew pin. <gasps> yes. Prosperity spell incense sticks. Yes, little lunar moon necklace. Yep, witch's hat, bracelet charm, handcrafted gourmet lollipop, and the art print. Yay! That is such a good box for a last box as well of the year. That's such a good one. You've just got so many cute things in there. Oh, I'm so happy! I think my favourite thing of everything is either the print, because that is just so cute and I, I'm a sucker for little black and white spooky prints, or the broom pin, because I've never seen anything like that before and that is just so cute. Everything's so witchy and I freaking love it. If you guys enjoyed this unboxing, I'm really sorry if I don't make a lot of sense during these videos. I'm just too excited to cope. <laughs> um, yeah, comment down below what your favourite thing was that I unboxed in this video. And if you guys are interested, as always, I'll link below the website and the Instagram. The Instagram's really cute because they um, repost pictures of people who've received boxes wearing or using the stuff that comes in it and that's really cool for either inspiration or just some cool pictures. Um, what's the other thing I wanted to mention? Oh, they also have a shop um, where instead of buying the boxes, you can buy things that came in the boxes. I don't believe everything that comes in the boxes is on there. 
some of the stuff is and definitely check it out either for yourself or your spooky friends your spooky mums i don't know whatever check it out it's pretty lit yep <laughs> thanks for watching and i'll see you guys next time bye